just because we wanted to make sure that it was open and got a real
Then, and my suit, look graciously at him, who's not so noble a friend I'm vain suppose, for the sour looks afflict his gentle heart. My lord, be one at last. Dissemble all your griefs and discontents. You are but newly planted in the throne. Lest then the people and patricians too, upon each survey, take Titus part, and so supplant you for ingratitude, which Rome reputes to be a heinous sin. Yield at the treats, and then let me alone. I'll find a day to massacre them all, embrace their faction and their family, the cruel father and his traitorous sons, to whom I sue for my dear son's life, and make them know what tis to let a queen kneel on the streets and beg for grace in vain. <clears throat> come, come, sweet emperor, come, Jonathan, take off this good old man that dies in fellows of thy angry frown. <laughs> Art my goddess, to thy law my services are bound. Wherefore should I stand in the plague of custom and permit the curiosity of nations to deprive me, for that I can some twelve or fourteen moonshines like a brother? Why, bastard? Wherefore base, when my dimensions are as well compact? My mind is generous and my shape as true as honest madame's issue. Why brand they us with base, with baseness, bastardy, base, base, who in the lusty self of nature take more composition and fierce quality than doth within a dull, stale, tired bed go to the creating a whole tribe of fops got between asleep and wake? Well then, legitimate Edgar, I must have your land. Our father's love is to the bastard Edmund. As to you, my legitimate, fine word legitimate, well, my legitimate, if this letter speed and my invention thrive, Edmund the base shall talk the legitimate. I grow, I prosper, now dogs, stand up for bastards. What? Do you tremble? Are you all afraid? Alas, I blame you not, for you are mortal, and mortal eyes cannot endure the devil. Avant, thou dreadful minister of hell! Thou hast but power o'er his mortal body, his soul thou canst not have, therefore be gone. Foul devil, for God's sake, hence, and trouble us not, for thou hast made the happy earth thy hell, Filled it with cursing cries and deep exclaims, If thou would like to view thy heinous deeds, Behold, this pattern of thy butcheries. Blush, blush, thou lump of foul deformity. O God, which this blood makes to revenge his death. O earth, which this blood drinks to revenge his death. Either heaven with lightning strike the murderer dead, Or earth take open wide and eat him quick, As thou dost swallow up this good king's blood, Which his, Hell governed arm hath to butcher it. <laughs> Figure on haste. And therefore, is love said to be a child, 
because in choice he is so oft beguiled, as waggish boys who game themselves for swear, so the boy love is perjured everywhere. For ere Demetrius looked on Hermia's eye, he hailed down oaths that he was only mine. And when this hail some heat from Hermia felt, so he dissolved, and showers of oaths did melt. I will go tell him of fair Hermia's flight, and to the wood will he tomorrow night pursue her, and for this intelligence, if I have thanks, it is a dear expense. But here in me not to my pain, and have his sight thither and back again. <laughs>